Yeah. His neutral is definitely his forte. You know, he he has a very straightforward approach. It's a lot of jump, side B, jump into whatever. But he just executes it so well. And he has a lot of patience in his neutral as well. And uh, with his punish game, you see a lot of just tilts and forward airs. And not as much of flex as you see from a lot of other fishes. So it's a nice change of pace. Probably already though with a good start. These two, these two play a lot, so they're very familiar. How to fight each other. I think they've been training for a while. Oh, barely misses. But yeah, like you were saying, these two play together a lot. They know each other's character, they know each other's individual play style, and uh, it's always fun seeing them fight. I love the, like, close quarters dancing. <laughs> I mean, that's always something I've thought about with you know, just dash dancing on side B. I think it's, like, something you, like, think about when you first play this game. Oh my god. So fast when he does it. I can just dash in full screen. And then you don't see anyone do it. Yeah. Pretty even right now. Both at three stocks. Yeah, <laughs> the fireball she needs from the Pretty good right now. <laughs> Love the Huffy call out there. And if you haven't seen Double A play before, uh, this is a player known for using the fireball. They pretty much base their entire play around it, and a lot of their play includes setting up traps and whatever else with fireball. And they're kind of just playing chess while you're playing Slap City. That's yeah. pretty much pretty much how it works. Double A plays Goddess how like a lot of Goddess player. Oh, I've got all these setups with Fireball. But, you know, as you start to play Goddess more, you realize that's really hard. And she's just good in, like, other aspects, so I'm gonna focus on that instead. Double A will spec into being the Fireball mask. Oh my god, that's dead! Absolutely crazy. Play with the lead. You know what you can. Extra credit, you can get this dog. Oh, it just goes for the, the raw upbeat. That's a, that's a Cosmos specialty. Cosmos will just upbeat you over and over and over. Oh. Now I'm carrying him off stage. That's it. Okay. That's slack for game one. With a pretty hefty lead. Yeah. 50%'s nothing to, nothing to laugh at. But as we know, Fish has an extremely explosive combo game, and if Double A or if Cosmos touches Double A, that could mean death. Yeah, Cosmos is such an expert in finding like, God is, like I feel like most other people like fighting God like, kind of struggle to kill her. Heavy, floaty, combo hard, it's not, and she the eyes blink. But Cosmos is so good at finding his skill out the stocks of the weavers relatively obviously. definitely cosmos closing that gap though racking up some percent on double a it's looking like it's just going to come down to whoever can land a stray smash attack oh the good up b double a was definitely trying to like seal out with the downer like up here. I think these two are just having fun going for crazy options. Up on Double A taking the first game. Double A was just so on point with their power shield. I was like right about to say again there the like... That uh, Double H has just been like power shielding so reliably for Cosmos. Cosmos 
something he's really big on is coming down with like fish bear. No, so safe on shield. The only things you can really do about it are you have to get out of the way and whip punish it, or you power shoot. Yeah, honestly, the way I know we were hyping up Cosmos as neutral earlier, but I think like there have been times where I fight double A, and even whenever they're not facing everything around Fireball, they have one of the most interesting neutrals I think of anyone I've played. I don't I don't know exactly how to explain it, but it's a lot of micro spacing or whatever you want to call it around dash dancing and sometimes it just feels like they're running in circles around me and i can't do anything about it yeah uh your mic is like echoing like oh it's like it's echoing your voice gotcha i was taking the first stock pretty good situation for double a get a few good hits get a grab up throw up throw knocks over That though, but Humpy's on stage. I have a bad habit, uh, the way kinda has, is he will Humpy on stage a lot. Um, so it's like, he knows, he's gotta know, it's super fun. It's F strong there, all the way across the uh oh. That could be dead? Cosmo's not gonna close out the stock with Humpy. Like, it's like gonna like down or something when he came back on stage. Yeah, double A likes to double A likes to threaten you whenever you push him into the corner. Those movies from the ledge. Oh my god, that didn't actually huh? crazy. And two two whole stocks taken. Now Cosmos is first. This is so different from this game. Longer. Really close the entire way through. This time Cosmos just running away with it. But the play finally takes the first dog. Okay. Uh oh. Be big. Just punish the tech in place. Okay, good downbeat. Getting them out of any bad situation there. <laughs> Death Strong barely not catching. Alright, this is big. That airstrong probably wouldn't have taken it, but it might have set up for another airstrong. Yeah, that way you can't be covering like that. Just cover on stage like that, and they get punished. Okay. Alright, hopefully. Yeah it's, my... yeah, it's better now. Okay, good. But <laughs> airstrong. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh Get man. the fun fish down throw. I oh, love to see the down throw. I forgot the fun. Yep, one one. Yeah, it's crazy to see how much the tide can shift whenever these two play. It's like one game, one of them will win. The very next game, Cosmos gets a three stock. <laughs> and it's just normal for these guys. <laughs> yeah, Cosmos definitely made some investments in that last game. It looks like Double A's made some in this game. Oh, goes for the bold forward smash. Oh my goodness. And that kills off the top. Oh, goes for the ricochet. Uh, I feel like Cosmos is like hitting openings. I don't know, he's getting counter hit by a double hit. Yeah, we're not we're not seeing uh, really any huge punishes from Cosmos, which you know, like we said, he's not particularly known for his crazy punish, but I feel as though he typically gets a bit more off of uh, his hits than what we're seeing right here. They're just playing the mind games, hitting the fireball back and forth.
Oh, almost catches. Yeah, if he would held a little bit longer, I'll be up A little bit of a lag. Like... Cosmos taking full advantage of it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> down smash. <laughs> the kill. It's a down smash on stage. Oh, <laughs> so unfortunate. I'm not sure how to commentate this right now. <laughs> it's just like a real awkward moment in the match. Yeah, like they're kind of playing neutral, but not really. They're kind of just messing around with the fireball. Cosmos <laughs> has just been so good about like reading when the play is gonna grow up and make like a bit more Yeah. Yeah, I think that ties into what we said earlier about how they just know each other, not just knowing each other's characters, but knowing just how the other one plays and all their tendencies and bad habits and whatever else it may be. They just know each other because they play so much and they play in tournaments so much as well. Oh. That's Cosmos just running away after he got a hit. Very interesting choice. Oh, almost did. Good jump, Air Definitely saves his skin. And believe it or not, this is pretty much even right now. Even though Double A is 69% on them. Goddess, if she touches fish, can rack that up like it's nothing. Oh, but yeah, that'll be it for Cosmos. Yeah, I think it's one of his bad habits, because he does it quite a bit. Yeah, he's just leaving himself super open. Well, let's do... I think we're doing Fruit and Cap next. This is best of five, I'm pretty Oh, Oh, yeah, you're right, you're right, I'm sorry. Of a I'll maybe take a little bit of either games. I feel so rude now for for saying it was over when it wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah, I, I wouldn't imagine so. These two are usually talking whenever they're playing, just having a good time. Well, Cosmos doing pretty well. Um, one of my biggest complaints, I guess, about Double A's Goddess is, yes, they're really good at using the fireball, but I feel like they sacrifice a lot of Goddess's really solid, consistent punish options by just going for crazy stuff with fireball, which I respect. I mean, if you know who I am as a player... I always just try to do whatever's cool. <laughs> so I, I get it. It's but just a uh, thing in a I, tournament setting. It's just a thing I see with a lot of goddesses. They they kind of they they get attracted by like all of goddesses like fireball, the counters, the F snatches. They kinda kinda don't really capitalize um some of goddesses like better at other attributes like good range, fantastic rounds being tied. Best in the game with the ground, in terms of uh, how fast they are on the ground. That play is definitely like makes it work really well. Yeah, it's it's cool though to see you know how Double A's approach to Goddess is so different than any other Goddess player that Slap has ever seen. You know they base everything around that one move pretty much, and. 
while it may not be optimal all the time, you know, it's it's cool to see. Your double A is just... Double A uses fireball, but he doesn't normal projectile. <laughs> yeah. It's a, like, it's a fireball. That, that's how I, I've heard it compared. It's like, they treat it like they're just throwing, you know, like, a joke. Use it to control space a lot more than like, other people use fireball. Other people are kind of using other goddesses will just use fireball. Oh, I'm gonna bait them into attacking. That's kind of all they do. So Double A uses it to kind of threaten space a lot, and he's he's ready to like punish you. Even if you're like, okay, I'm just not gonna I'm not gonna interact with fireball. He's just so good at like utilizing every part of. That's not quite dead. Oh, barely misses with that dumbo. Big punish. Yeah, oh, I dead. love that. Love that. Looking like we're gonna go to game five here. Double A in my spot. I wouldn't count Kazma's out. Yeah, any, definitely if any not. Any player in the world overcome this deficit right now. I think it's possible. Grace, I'm saying that he's played, not letting that happen. <laughs> Just immediately killing him. It's the same thing again. That neutral B and the air strong is so cool. Yeah. And they're going right back into it. No delay. Game five. And as we've seen throughout the set, uh, their games are pretty much just a toss-up. It's just whoever does better in that one game. <laughs> oh. okay. Not so right there, uh, we saw something that I think, you know, Cosmos is a super good player, but one thing I feel like they could add to their armory would be... Like I said, we see a lot of the forward airs and the tilts and whatnot, but right there, um, he could have wave dashed onto stage and went for a flex or something and covered, but instead he dropped and went for the forward air, which was just too slow and he didn't get the punish on double A. It's just a lot of small stuff. Oh, and that's gonna kill. I can't. You know, I should just shut up. He's the one. He's the one in winner side, top eight. So oh, I'm yeah. just gonna shut up and let him do his thing. I can't believe he got that. The Cosmo's looking pretty good. <laughs> pretty good. Alright. Oh, that play just didn't hold it long. Jimmy thought, you know, Cosmo's would be able to get out of it, but. Cosmo's oh. just gotta stop doing that. He just keeps. <laughs> He just keeps daring on the uh, fireball. No place for oh my god, that guy! Yeah, right now I think he's kind of just going with the momentum and just running at double A, which I, <laughs> I respect he's, uh, it. He's just letting God take the wheel. I guess. I mean, I understand that sometimes during this situation, I've been so, like after like kind of kind of close games, like you just kind of figure something out. Alright, I'm just gonna run the Yeah, I mean it definitely it's working as we're seeing right now. He's kinda it's kinda messing up double A right now. I would I would have liked to have seen it up the Or chance. <laughs> Goes for the crazy bounce. Oh, Get <laughs> He's just throwing out forward him. It's like it's no one's business. Oh. <laughs> that's dead? No. Oh, that's. I think that's it. Yeah. What the? <laughs> what a way to end. Cosmos sending double A. Sending them uh, crying back to, or not back to loser side, but sending them crying to losers. <laughs>